Hey, I have something to show you. Today I want to talk about the conductive pan. This thing is awesome. It's made by Circuit Works. Right now you can buy it for 40 bucks. If you want to buy Circuit Works brand, this is a silver type. They make a nickel, which is about 10 bucks. You can buy. Works the same way. It's all conductive. Um, what this thing will do? If you have a trace that's corroded or broken or just it's not making good connection anymore, instead of using a wire jumper like that or a coated wire jumper like this. You can make it look much more professional by using this pen. And it'll look like this when you get done with it. I have the standard tip and it's made a connection from one point to the other and I broke it in the middle to show you that you can still scratch it off once you get done with it. Now, if you use a low heat iron around 200 degrees, you can still solder this without melting the paint of this conductive ink. Um, you can buy the overcoat pen to overcoat that, and you won't have to worry about anybody shocking themselves. And there's something that I recommend for anybody to buy. It's a conductive pen. Paint on many different surfaces. If you want to paint it on wood, then lay across an LED and a battery and whatnot. Test out a simple circuit. You can do that. You can just about do anything with your imagination with this conductive pen. Um, to make sure and show you that it's valid, with this conductive pen actually work? I know it sounds strange and true, but on the far right here, you'll read. My meter is showing it's open, and this is closed, and this is across what I just painted on. And it has a consistency of white out, and you kind of have to plunge it up and down in order for it to work correctly. And once you get it started, it'll kind of puddle a little bit and you just kind of drag it along. Now if I had the micro tip, it would work much, much better than what I have for the standard tip. But you pretty much put traces anywhere you want to paint it onto. And if you wanted to, you know, make different designs of a prototype and like your conductor pen do all kinds of strange stuff, you can do that. Now, if this is an actual valid board, once that dries, everything that's in this little area is now connected. <laughs> so you want to be careful when you're using this. You can always take them. When you're done with that dry, you can take and scratch off the areas that you don't want connected to and without any problems. So, hopefully you'll run out and maybe buy the off-brand. You don't have to pay 40 bucks for it. The off-brand is about 20 bucks. I had actually bought a kit that had this, the microchip, and the overcoat pen for $45, I believe. And I used it on the motherboard for a computer and pretty much got my money back. So I got all this for free. So that's what I charged the lady to fix her motherboard. And I had corrosive from a uh, leaky capacitor. So, this thing is about six to eight years when I had this. And I've stored it outside in the garage, and one day at work, I decided to show somebody at work what we have, what could we, we could have at work and use this. So, we deal with a lot of circuit boards and repairing and rebuilding boards. So, if you go out and buy yourself a conductive pen, uh, send me a link or an email in my YouTube and I will be interested to see what you can do with this. Um, thanks for watching and have a good day.